Hey guys, welcome back to Synth Place Transport Fever. This is my 5 metal playthrough or attempt, let's call it attempt, of the American campaign. This is the first mission and it is tough as nails to get the medals. Now, first thing first, these three medals here are easy to do and you will see where, why in a minute. These two are very hard. Especially this one seems to be buggy, so I guess the date here is wrong and you need to be, be done earlier. So, okay, now because I finished the game already before May 874, I finished in March 74, I didn't get the medal. Also, uh, I never took a loan, but I didn't get this medal either. And it seems that also I did finish the game without ever going into the red, and it didn't trigger this medal. And it seems that you cannot trigger the additional loan mission not taking the loan but just trigger the, the option to take another loan so keep that in mind so yeah we're gonna start and yeah I'm doing this like four or six time now so I'm just gonna brute force through it now just follow my uh, just follow what I see and have fun <coughs> it's really bothersome, I have to say. The mission is very hard to finish in the time. It's very easy to finish if you don't bother for the medals, but it's really tough to finish with the last two medals. Especially if they take out the loan mission you didn't really know when it will pop up so it's very tough so now I'm gonna and I'm gonna save the game now after each event triggered so so in case uh, something goes wrong I just have to reload the last trigger I do I do save enough a lot but not enough it seems so there we go, we have the four grains. So that will trigger. Okay, pause the game, save. As you can see uh, several several save games already. There we go. Now I have to connect the next city from here cannot build when doing a pause pause game which seems weird but whatever Okay, now here we have some unhappy Indians. Just buy, exchange the land. Now, before we go any further here, we have here the iron ore and the steel mill. And now you could connect this with a train, of course, but I realized that the initial cost of the train is too much. To make uh, it worthwhile in time, it makes it will eventually make a lot of money, especially if you can deliver tools back and forth. But the initial costs are so much, so high, 
that you will like unlikely ever reach it reach its potential to be actually of use so instead I'm going to set up a router connection here believe me it's just as a, it's more, way more efficient because the problem is that the train with not only cost it a lot to buy the train and the wagons each wagon is 200k for a capacity of 8 and uh, yeah the, the train is very slow and it's not very efficient so we're gonna set up a little delivery from here take the iron from here goes but as far as down as can from here okay and deliver it down here again go as fast as you can there we go okay new line from here to here straight down back forth back forth and then we're gonna make another station from here yeah, no, it just doesn't matter. Somewhere here. And then we can deliver tools over here. And then we do the same thing. We can do the line already. Okay. Let's let it go back and forth here. same thing over here and believe me this is a lot more efficient than a train would ever be when a train a train would eventually make more money just the problem is that by the time you make enough money that it actually helps you the time is over so of no use now here, okay, two for this line here, and I think we have to take this line here, the green line, yes, there you go, hurry up a little, Also, there's a metal to have tools tools built before a certain event is triggered, so that's good. Yeah, the advantage with the carriages is that you can buy a lot, lot, and lots and lots of them, and they cost basically nothing. You can have a, a hundred of these, cost less than a, a single locomotive. As you can see here, if you if you look at the the locomotives, just a normal one, costs already 50,000 a year, and that's without anything. And then you have 36,000 a year for each carriage or cargo for a free dragon. And believe me, that really piles up. Well, this year, it's slow and everything, yes, it's very slow, but the, the distance isn't that big. And uh, if you have like 20, 30, 40 carriages going back and forth, then pays off. Believe me. So while this is doing this, we can actually advance here, just in case. Like so. so as soon as you see that the characters are gone here, Buy four more, four more, four more, four more. So straight up.
There you go. Now, again, yeah, it's set already for more. As you can see here, there's a new trigger. It's the gold nugget. Simply click through. There we go. And now we have to dig here in order to get the nugget. Nugget doesn't do anything else to give a metal. Where is it? Where is the nugget? Never took that long. What the hell? Yeah, this is not going to work out here. I uh, got the load. You can see why this missions can piss me off, can piss someone off because there's so much randomness involved. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Okay, we are back. I have to reload the game here because something stupid happened. Anyway, not gonna bother here a long time. Just set up a couple of these. Then we're gonna build the line here. straight up as possible okay so there we go <coughs> now save the game I don't save enough seriously Yes, I got this stupid gold nugget quest. Uh, I'd reload the quest because I spent like half a million finding the gold nugget, which I didn't. I, I didn't actually find the gold nugget. That's the problem. Uh, hardly enough. I mean, I did what I always do. I did it like three times now. We have here. We have this spot here. Okay. And you have to dig. So I'm gonna save again just in case before I start digging here. Usually it's about here around here. I'm just gonna circle like this. There we go. Before I did it spent like five hundred thousand or six hundred thousand and didn't find it. So okay. We have this done. Save again. So we really really have to be safe trigger in this game. Okay, let's see now. Okay. 
Okay. So now we have to connect these different wells here. Go. Again, the train, the fastest you can get with a train in this scenario is 50 km an hour. You have a lock that can do 60, but uh, the wagons can only do 50, so that's the limit. So I'm going to build train station here. There we go. Don't trigger the next event because it's triggered by having a production here. So as soon as long as you don't have any production here, don't trigger the next event. Save the game. There you go. And wait for the for your delivery here. And then add more vehicles. We want to keep this rise really nice and tight here. Now the the metal says you have to be prepared with the tools and have produced. The, once you trigger the next event, once you end the strike, it will ask you for ten tools. So I don't know if you have to deliver 10 tools at once which would be a bit tough or if you have to build have to have made 10 tools before so we have an auto save here so we're gonna try if it there we go it's it's uh, it's it worked already you don't need 10 tools in the factory but I guess you have to add 10 tools produced already so that's done. Slow down the game. On we go. Outstanding. So now all that's left is these two here. Which means be careful with the money. Don't trigger the need alone event. As you can see you really have to move this up here. Uh, fastest. Now we are eight years ahead, so we are still very fine. We are very good here. We're actually very good. That's actually the best playthrough I had so far, I think. Guess after five, six failed attempts, you really know how to streamline this, this stuff here. Especially this, the, the direct line from here to here is really the ten true lines that deliver sidewards here. That's really working well because you have the shortest possible delivery way, uh, distances here. As you can see it is really starting to deliver, to produce. As you can see the, the carriages they pretty much pay for themselves as soon as they deliver the first load. and. Uh, I don't have to actually deliver tool upwards as well. Should. I guess they built. They send tools to Laramie first, I guess. Before they do anything else. It's kind of odd. Should deliver tools upwards as well. Ah! Of course. Maybe. Yeah, that's possible. Let me see here. Uh. This one here. So we're gonna set one from here. And then delete this one here. And then the line, 
uh, which one is it? Uh, not the line one, line three. No line four. Remove this. We add station from here to here. Okay. Now we should be close enough so there is actually demand. That's I forgot about that. Because here it delivers to here, but after it has to be able to deliver from here to here, which it won't do unless there is a close enough depot or station. But now it should be able to deliver tools as well soon. Also need more iron. Really, really make this line work. You want no waiting time in this in this line. You pump it up. So yeah, what's next? Well, this is working down there. We're going to connect Octon. Octon. Okay. Now here you want to go close to the to the street again. Here it costs a lot of money to pass through, so stay near the the street. Or the road. What's the difference between a road and a street? Is the street inside the city and the road outside? Or is the road... What's, well, I don't know. Who tell me? Um, train station. Now be careful here. I don't want to trigger the, the loan option. I don't know at what point this, it triggers, so... I want to slow down a bit with the spending money. Save the game just in case. Okay. So it should upgrade soon. Like you can see now it delivers tools as well. So there should be a lot more money coming in soon. From this carriages here. And I'm not sure if I mentioned it in this playthrough. I've said it like five times before, but that's of course in the failed attempts. Uh, if my voice sounds a bit muffled, it's because I'm a bit sick or ill. I got my car, I caught a cold, nothing big, but uh, my nose is pretty much closed up, and uh, so yeah, I'm a bit muffled, so I say, so, so to speak. This is the, um, there are many, how many wagons we can actually send here before it starts to fill up. You have to say, uh, take account about two years to finish the mission at the end. So you have to be able to send the train more or less in May to, uh, 72 in order to be able to finish the mission in time. And again, I actually finished the mission before uh, 
with time to spare and I didn't trigger the metal so maybe want to finish it a bit earlier See this upgraded now, so it produces even more, way, way more. Seems overkill, maybe it is, but it's the best way in this scenario to make money steadily, because it doesn't cost a lot. Okay, now we have the point where it's actually waiting, which means we should be a soon be at the, yeah, it looks good. I saved the game because I don't want, I really am afraid of triggering the take a loan up, take a loan thingy, things, things, whatever it's called, mission. Uh, let's see. Hmm. But I guess we go just around. I'm gonna build a train. Okay, and now it tells me. Okay, another safe game here. And now we build around the city here. Yes, there's another production place here, but uh, not gonna bother with that. Would make anything. Would make big of a difference. Okay, here now here follow the street. There you go. Really hope you don't trigger the the loan mission. Take out the loan mission. Because again, I have no idea how may, how much or how little at what point it triggers. Before I do this again, save the game just in case. Wow, I didn't trigger anything right now, but now we have to wait to make some money. I could sell everything here, but uh, then I risk to drop. So we have still we have like two and a half years left of making money, so just wait here.
I really, really, really want to make sure that uh, I don't take a trigger the mission, the, the, the lone mission. This one is upgraded as well. Two years, right? In two years to make enough money for the train, right? Enough money to make the train and not trigger the mission. That's the most important part of the thing. I'm gonna set up the line already. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. That's done. We're getting there. There we go now with Peaking. I have to wait for my money. I think in 71 we should have enough money to be able to buy the train and send it on his way. Uh, hopefully. can see now we have really the, the line is really saturated now so there is no nothing we can do just wait for the money to come in as you can see now the line is a steady flow of money coming in Almost there. Let's kind of see uh, the train here. We want, we want this locomotive here, so we don't want to trigger the loan event. So we have to wait a little bit. I'm not making any money here. Yeah. 
No, they're not really loaded. Um, I just tried to sell every vehicle and then buy a train, but that was not a good idea. So I'm simply going for the cheaper version. I, I, I had enough money to buy the train, but it would trigger the get alone mission. So, so I don't go for this one. I just go for this one with uh, one of these. There we go. Set it to the line five. And now, then it's trip. It has almost three years. And again, the max speed on this line is 50 kilometers anyway. The wagon can only do 50, so this train should be enough to handle this and hopefully get through in time to trigger the, the, all the metals. So again, I finished the mission before with time to spare and I didn't trigger the metal. So there's probably something wrong with it, maybe a typo in the mission. Because it always seems weird that it says May 84, uh, 74. Uh, it seems more likely to be January 74 or something. Let's see. Where's the train? We have to have, have our train here. Let's follow it. Hopefully, we will never drop. As much that we need uh, that the trick is the loan mission, hopefully. I just hope that this is enough to pa to pay for this. Okay, it's really you have to really streamline this mission in order to get it done. But I haven't yet uh, get it done, so I hope I get it done now. Get it done. Yeah. So let's follow the train. Here we have people waiting here. Just follow it. Two years to go. I actually have too many. Oh my god. We have too many now. So I guess we're gonna change this here to just deliver and take up, deliver, take up, deliver, take up. Don't wait. Guess I went a bit overboard here with the Okay, that's fine. There he is. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. About halfway through. A bit more. We we're, we're fine. Time wise, we're fine. But again, uh, I'm not sure at what point to check exactly what exactly triggers this metal here. Because it definitely is May 74. Because I finished before this, like I said, uh, this is. I think this should trigger now because I never went into the red. I never triggered uh, more the the next loan uh, mission, so that should be fine. Um, keep this. It looks like we are staying stable here. So just a question of this one here. Quite honestly, if I don't get it in this mission here, because I clearly pass, then I will upload this video anyway. Because then uh, I don't want to bother with uh, a buggy mission. So if you see this video and uh, wonder, oh, they didn't get this mission here, that's well. I am delivering clearly before 74. Well, clearly. I'm going to deliver before May 74. So in my book, I get the medal. So let's finish this course here. Last couple minutes. Two three minutes. A full year to spare. A full year to go just for this distance here. That should be fine, I think. We are making money, so so I never got to get a loan prompt. 
which means I never lost money, I never went below 300,000 or something I think it is. Um, so we should get this medal as well, hopefully. And again it took me like 6 attempts to get this right, because it's very tight. The timetable on this mission is very tight. The money is very little. You have very little money uh, to work with, and there is not much to do, and you have to do it right. So, then I'm doing the mistakes. If you look at my videos and think, hey, the guy is too good or whatever, then no, it's not that I'm too good, or maybe I'm good, I'm not too good, but it's mostly because I'm persistent. I really, really, really want to uh, finish what I start. So just keep in mind that for every 10 minutes of video that you see, I probably recorded 2 hours. Uh, sometimes more. For some missions uh, I go days trying to figure out a way to unlock all the medals. Because it seems like the, they weren't really tested before delivery. So let's see if we finish this now. Let's see what happens. I have a year to spare. Oh my god, I did it. Well, there you go. Five medals. Took me only like four or five hours to finish. Uh, so we see you soon in the next mission. Thanks for watching. I'm Sin. Bye.